Here are this week's AT&T Goal of the Week nominees. Over the top, and onside is Arietta with an opportunity to level a match. How about that? 2-2! Two -two! Morosevic with a great through ball and getting kept onside by Tandy and then saved that one. I mean, that is just smashed into the top corner. And those are nearly unstoppable. What a strike from the young Costa Rican on his birthday. Birthday gift, just 29 years young today. And just plays the game the way it's supposed to be played, all out. Ferrier, Devayo is onside this time. And talking of Italians, there's the one, the impact lock. Well, finally he stays onside. Just what he's been wishing for. Bernier just paused it, it's just enough. He's been kept onside by the man in the middle, and he makes no mistake, what a finish. Far side, goalkeeper has no chance. Bernier was always gonna pick him out, and look at the time he has. Guys that know how to control the pace of the match. Blaine, for the lead! Are you kidding me? Two goals in a game. Oh, I'll tell you what, look at that again. Poor Maurice, what can you do? Rosales, plenty ahead of him, including Freddy Montero. Fantastic movement again, even better skill! It's the hat trick for Freddy Montero, the first of his soundest career. What a way to respond. What happens, Montero runs in behind this Chivas defense one more time. Mauro Rosales finds him. Freddy cuts the ball back, has the time to shape it one more time. Well done by Alan Gordon to bring that ball down. That's a beautiful ball across. Dawkins, Simon Dawkins cuts to his strong foot and he's hit. First, first goal of the match goes to the Quakes. Simon Dawkins is fifth of the year. You see him bring that ball down, and just the vision to see Simon Dawkins out wide so far. And Simon, he can go right, he can go left this time, cuts inside, beats Matt Pickens near post. Beautiful, beautiful team goal from the Earthquakes. And he turns the defender around. 